they were in our front here. This is 14 feet of living space and it is our regular width. So it's got a room for a bathroom or a composting toilet. Um, it is a pretty special order and I will show you why. So these people had a few requirements and one of them was that they did not need the trundle bed but they wanted somewhere for their dogs to stay. So they came up with the idea that they would just have everything under the bed is for their dogs. So we've got compartments built in so that the dogs can't get into their utilities and it does have a fan so that we can circulate some air back there. Um, it's got two doors from the outside that they can climb through. And then it's got a custom made, basically like a, a dog crate door that they can be locked in, but still have some air and still see out into the living space. One of the other items that they requested is a room for a composting toilet. So right here we've got that room. Um, the composting toilets are a little on back order. So these guys are gonna come pick their camp up and use it for a little bit. And then we'll install that composting toilet when it gets here. They also ask for a deck for their four-wheeler and they wanted the metal grate on there, extended metal, um, so they can put their camp chairs out there when they're not using it for the four-wheeler or they can load their four-wheeler on there. They also did the 40-pound propane tanks instead of just the 30. They did not want the, the cooktop, and so they changed the position of where their fridge is going. They wanted it right there with a little bit of storage above. So their closet will be up there, and then they've got a drawer that they can put some things in. So that changed up the layout just a little bit. And then it's got some counter space there and some storage beneath and then their large wood stove and the wood box below. And on the other side, we've got our kitchen area with the sink and it's going to be just the simple hand pump faucet with a five gallon drum of water underneath um, and a couple of storage compartments that they can put some of their pots and pans or bigger items and then they wanted a smaller camp and so we narrowed down these benches for them with the remaining space. Even with the smaller benches, there's room for each of them, one on each side. The table will pull out nicely and they can sit and eat, then fold it back in, let their dogs out. They'll have a nice camping trip.
Here we've got one final look around. Another thing that they did was they went for two gas lights. So one by their bed and then one in the kitchen area. And with a lot of our frontiers, it's got a little bit of a headboard there with some storage inside. And your 12 volt outlets. One in the kitchen and one by the bed.